There are happy marriages and unhappy marriages, but there is also such a thing as holy marriages. Some married couples achieve holiness together, like the blesseds Luigi and Maria Corsini Beltrame Quattrocchi, or the parents of Saint Therese, Louis Martin and Marie Celi Guarin. In these relationships, two people shared their lives and strive to follow God's example. We went to St. Peter's Square to ask couples if it's possible to achieve holiness in marriage. Yeah, I believe yes, because uh, we have to bring uh, all the God and blessing and all the church values to, to, to build our, our marriage. I believe so. We, we have to uh, bring God to our home so our marriage to be happy. I think they can if they're very good to each other and good to each other's family and if they live good Christian lives, I think it's very possible to become a saint in marriage, yes. Yes, I think if you try and uh, live a good life and try and follow what God would like you to do, I think it's possible. Pierce and Siniad are from Ireland and they became engaged two years ago in St. Peter's Square. The couple decided to get married in Rome. These are the virtues that they believe can be learned within a marriage. I think maybe a kindness, um, a generosity, uh, being good to each other are the most important virtues for a happy marriage. Yes, I think looking after one another and each other's family and my new family now is, is uh, good for marriage. Paula and Luca are from Brazil. They came to Rome to receive the Pope's blessing in their marriage. They also believe that many virtues are cultivated during marriage. I think uh, love, respect, union, friendship. friendship, friendship, yes. It's no secret that marriage isn't simple. After the celebrations end, difficult times come for all couples. Pope Francis has offered advice on this topic many times. Litigate quanto volete. Se volano i piatti, lasciate. Ma mai finire la giornata senza fare la pace. Mai. E per fare la pace, Non è necessario chiamare alle Nazioni Unite che vengano alla casa a fare la pace. Eh, è sufficiente un piccolo gesto, una carezza, ma ciao. Eh, a domani. E domani si incomincia un'altra volta. Both couples agree that the sanctity of marriage depends on whether both people act as if they are one unit and if there is mutual respect. It is a difficult path, but it's certainly been accomplished many times before.